Hi everyone, it's Merc007 here again and I got something new in the mail the other day. When I ordered this I also got some free gel refills and yeah, I, I didn't have to pay for these. So thank you to the seller. Okay, let's have a look at this. There's a paper sleeve. And this very cute tin. Okay, it got an award. Okay. There's a caution warning saying don't put it near anything that might be affected by magnets. Okay, keep away from fire and not to be used by persons with a cardiac pacemaker. Some instructions which I will have a look at. We get some black ink. Okay, there's five of those. And a very, very nicely packaged pen. Let's have a closer look. Okay, there's a USB charging port there. Okay, on the cap there is this uh, indentation. Um, the material used on this is like a matte type finish. Okay, it's very easy to pull off the cap. And unfortunately, oh, maybe, maybe this way. And unfortunately, the cap doesn't go on here. And I tried this side, but it also doesn't fit. see what happens. Okay, it's already got some battery. Press once and it goes into the standard mode. Press the button two times quickly. Okay, and then it speeds up. Then to stop the pen, press twice again to go back into the standard mode and then press to stop the pen. It already comes with some ink, okay, and to change the ink, unscrew the barrel. All the inks come with a protective coating at the top, okay, so you should take that off before using it. Okay, let's give this a try. So they say you should hold the pen upright like this. And if you hold it this way, ah, so if you hold it slanted it won't make the dots as well. Okay, so if you go this way. And I'm actually barely touching the paper. Now if I if I hold the pen closer to the paper, it'll go like that. Okay, and then if I go quickly. Okay, let's try it in the faster mode. Whoa. That is awesome. If I hold the pen closer to the paper, you don't really feel the vibration much. Let's try going in a circle. 
Back to the standard a circle. Okay, the standard is a lot easier to control. Okay, let's try drawing something. Can you guess what I'm trying to draw? I wonder if I can do my little sign here. Let's give it a go. Okay, drawn on June 24th, 2017. Okay, so what do you think? That was just a quick doodle of an octopus. Because it's a little bit fitting with the cuddle Lola.
Okay, the pen does kind of get a little bit warm. It's not too bad. Okay, I'm very interested to see what these colors turn out like. Okay, which one should we try? How about this orange? Okay, so this sometimes accidentally pops out, but it looks like it should be pretty easy to pop back in. Let's see if this still works. Okay, that clicked back in. Ooh, you can barely see it. I think this color is kind of fluoro. So if we had some darker paper, which I don't have, you might be able to see it more. Okay, let's try the purple, since purple is one of my favorite colors. Okay, the purple feels a little different. So maybe because of the protective coating, there's still a little bit of um, blockage at the end. Okay. As you can see, sometimes the ink doesn't come out. Well, that time it's better. Okay, I think I'm actually running out of battery. Okay, so let's stop that for now. Okay, so the battery, uh, one charge should last about 30 minutes, it says, which is quite good, considering I was able to doodle this really quickly. Um, I really, really like it. The design of this pen is very, very good. While I was changing the ink back to black, I noticed this. So the pen is quite magnetic but it's not um, strong enough to pick up the metal tin. Okay, but it's strong enough to pick up the pen. Okay, so my final thoughts on the pen. Um, it's actually a really, really cool pen. Uh, I think this will be a great tool for people who like to draw. The design is actually really, really good. Uh, very easy to use. I do wish there was some way to keep the cap on the pen so you don't lose it. Um, but otherwise, it's really, really cool. And I think I'm going to use this to draw a few more things. It's very easy to use, by the way. There's not a big learning curve as long as you read the instructions. Okay, and hold the pen upright when you, when you draw. Uh, it doesn't take too long to get used to. Definitely recommend the black ink. I think that's the coolest ink. It already comes with a pack in the tin. Um, and I was very lucky to get some free inks as well. Um, I haven't tried the blue ink. Hopefully that'll be good too. This orange ink is really hard to see. Um, I don't know what you can use this for. Maybe on like darker paper perhaps. I was able to store three packs of these in the space here and I'm sure I can store more here okay but I don't foresee myself using the orange a lot okay this is actually a really really cool gadget in Japan you can get this on Amazon uh, it is a little pricey about a hundred US dollars or more about Ichiman Nisei en 
But if you're an artist and you like to draw, I think this is an awesome tool to add to your collection. Okay. What a beautiful design. Okay, this is by Dongguan Dots Trading Company Limited. Okay, and that is the email address. Dotspen.com Very awesome. I hope you enjoyed my video. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, today I'm actually using a new iPod stand and it's actually hooked up to the top of my shelf so it does bounce a little if I accidentally touch the, the arm. Feel free to comment on the quality of the video below and thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!